Welcome to Quincy Railroad. We got a lot of fun things for you to do here today, so let's get started with the Wild West train ride, being that you're already here. You're sitting behind a real cold, burning steam locomotive, so you might just get a painful cinder in your eye. The good folks at the first aid station will be happy to help get it out for you. Pulling our train today is locomotive number 190, the Yukon Queen, built in 1943 by the Baldwin Locomotive Works of Philadelphia by the U.S. Army. She served in Alaska during World War II and was brought to Casey Railroad in 1960 to serve alongside locomotive number 12, the original Twinsy engine. From 1918 to 1940, number 12 ran on the East Tennessee and Western North Carolina Railroad, or E.T. and W.A.C., between Johnson City, Tennessee and Boone. Folks back then used to say proudly that E.T. and W.A.C. also stood for every time and with no complaint. During the troubles of the Great Depression, local folks joked that it could also stand for eat taters and wear no clothes. The train earned the nickname Twinsy because of the sound of its whistle echoing through these mountains. Before we get started, I just want to remind you to stay in your seats while the train is moving. And you'll be sure to keep your arms and head inside the train cars at all times. You never know when a desperado or a tree limb might just sneak up on you. We want you all to be safe and have fun riding the Quincy Railroad. Also know that smoking is not allowed on the train, except of course for the engine. Our train will be leaving the station in just a few minutes, so be sure to stay in your seats. Riding the train with you today are the Creeks Cowboys and Cowgirls. They're going to introduce themselves to you and tell you anything else you might need to know. We're so glad you're here today, and we hope you enjoy your ride on the Tweetsie Railroad.
All aboard, Casey Jones, let's ride. Train's cleared. Thank you. 